This is Switch and Shoot. It's a brand new retro-inspired shoot-em-up from developer Matt Glanville. It may look like a fairly typical throwback action game, but this shooter is packing a really cool gimmick. I know you have some questions about the Steam Early Access release, so let's crib this. I miss words separated by an N. Well, that's an interesting confession. You don't see that naming convention much these days, but it was all the rage during the 1980s and 90s. Look no further than Ghosts and Goblins, Bump and Jump, Slam and Jam, Crash and Burn, and even Lock and Chase. But you don't see much of that anymore, which gives Switch and Shoot a fun retro vibe even before you press start. This is a devilishly addictive variation on old school shoot 'em ups like Galaga and Space Invaders. The gimmick here is that you can play the game one handed, since the only thing you need to do is shoot. Actually, it's a little bit more complicated than that. As a rule, your ship will always be moving in one direction or another. Every time you shoot a bullet, your ship will switch directions. So you'll not only need to plan your every shot carefully, but also factor in that your ship will constantly change directions. Oh, that sounds kind of tough. It's a little confusing at first, but it didn't take long before it became second nature. Shooting at enemies is made easier when you pick up the falling upgrades, allowing for both wider and more spread out shots. The goal is to level up your ship all the way, and then snag another power up to move on to the next stage. But don't get too cocky, because you lose all your power ups every time you enter a new stage. And if you manage to miss a power up drop, your ship will be downgraded. So it's vitally important to pick up every power up and keep advancing through the stages. Is that all there is? Yes, at least for now. You aren't gonna buy this looking for cutting edge graphics or multi-part boss battles. This is a very simple score challenge where you're constantly trying to top your last run. About the most you can do is customize the color scheme adjusting every single aspect of the visuals. This allows you to create some horrendous eyesores, but at least the option is there. The rest of your time will be spent trying to keep your ship under control. Switch and Shoot is a slight game that is a lot of fun in short doses. I doubt anybody will spend hours glued to the computer screen. But I certainly had fun jumping in and playing for a few minutes at a time. I love the concept and hope a little bit more variety is added to the finished product, both when it comes to the background graphics and enemy units. The Steam Early Access build is currently $1.99, which is a fantastic price for what you get. You may not get dozens of hours out of it, but Switch and Shoot is certainly worth $2. Hey, thanks for watching our preview. This is a game I intended to talk about last week, but a foot injury got in the way. The good news is that I'm back in action this week, ready to post a bunch of reviews, previews, and more. We'll be taking a look at the newest Worms game, Doggos, Last Will, Valkyrius Prime, Crinkle Crusher, and more. So, do me a favor and click on the subscribe button and support what we're doing here. Until then.